idea how fast we're going, but we're definitely we're wide open. Very smooth motor so far. There's my wife out there on her Hobie. Very smooth motor. Sounds like a Honda. Very similar. All right, dead stop with with current. All right, we're gonna go dead stop here with current here, so you guys can see the acceleration. And there's my beautiful wife on her Hobie with stabilizers, and soon to be electrified today. I don't know if she'll do it though. We'll see. I'll be back. Speedo it now into the current. Going with the current is pretty, it gives you a false sense of how fast it is. So, man, this thing turns on a dime. All right, so let's give it a whirl again. All right, guys, so here we are at Matheson Hammock uh, testing out the new Lifon 35cc motor. Again, everything works the same as the Honda. I kept the actual side mount on and off switch as well, so it basically is a plug in, plug out if you want to use it. I don't care. I've been running like, I don't know, 30 minutes, and I got probably two thirds of a tank left. Again, everything else works really good, man. Surprisingly, starts really easy. Again, nothing different in comparison to the Honda. Now, the only thing I'll point out, I know for a fact because that is just galvanized steel, that's gonna probably rust, but that will be coming off on the RTR models. That's coming completely off, all that's coming off. Because we actually have the fixture that goes up inside here, so that's gone, so regardless of that. I'll WD-40 it, clean it up. There is metal plates inside, which I noticed are air deflectors, which are much nicer than a lot of the other models. Everything's encased, including the muffler, which I like. That muffler is fully encased, so you can't burn yourself, which is really good. So somebody thought about that on the design. Again, runs very cool. Very cool to the touch. Almost cooler than the Honda. So obviously, Honda is still my preference, but these these are definitely a damn good choice for a secondary backup. So far, I'm sweetly impressed. Again, it's like with the same waterproof connector on it, which can come right off and you can go back to regular on and off. Now, I will, I will mount this on the next version. So, But for a demo, this has been a fantastic run today. Very fuel efficient, easy to start. I think I'm gonna make some type of connector up here just to keep that off the, uh, the plastic. I don't know But everything else remains the same. Again, we are good to go. You'll see that I run the kill switch fully down the boat in a waterproof Apache box from Harbor Freight. Because so I get the chemo chunk in there too. And it's completely movable. And it doesn't slide or nothing. It hooks up in there. So, very cool. All right. Well, for now, we'll get some more film a little bit.